Jesus, you are worthy to be praised. You are worthy to receive all honor and glory. We magnify your name, O oh God. O oh Father, God Almighty, you are worthy to receive all honor and praise. We thank you because you alone are God and you are God all by yourself. Amen. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Welcome, welcome. Facebook um, uh, members, welcome. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Thank you. We pray that tonight, oh God Almighty, that you will always be blessed. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Thank you. Welcome back again to the kingdom mandate of Jesus Christ ministry, the house where God lives. Amen. Glory be to God. And so tonight, our topic tonight is you are on the winning side. Amen. You are on the winning side. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. I'm telling you, once you are, uh, glory be to God, under the covering of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, you are on the winning side and there is no losing in him. Amen. Glory be to God. There is no losing in him. You cannot lose. You cannot fail. Amen. Glory be to God. As long as you worship him in spirit and in truth, you can never fail. Amen. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. The greater one is in you. Amen. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Glory be to God. The greater one is in you. Thank you, Father. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Because it says greater is he that is in us than he that is in the world. Amen. And so therefore, if the greater one is in you, you cannot fail. Amen. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. And so therefore, our topic today is taken from glory be to God. It's taken from, hallelujah, Deuteronomy 1 to 4. And we are, our topic is you are on the winning side. Amen. Glory be to God. You are on the winning side. Glory be to God. And it says here in Deuteronomy 1, uh, 20 verse 1, it says, When thou goest out to battle against thine enemies and seest horses and chariots and a people more than thou, be not afraid of them, for the Lord thy God is with thee, which brought thee out of Egypt, out of the land of Egypt. Glory be to God. So it tells you that it doesn't matter how many as rise up against you. Glory be to God. It doesn't matter how much come out against you. It doesn't matter what the plans of the enemy are against your life, against your family, against your children. Glory be to God. It tells us, oh God, Almighty, that we are not to be afraid of them. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. It tells us that we should not be afraid. Glory be to God. Why? Because, oh God Almighty, for the Lord thy God is with us. Amen. The Lord thy God is with us. And so, therefore, oh glory be to God, it just confirmed that we cannot live a life of fear. We cannot live a life, ah, uh, God Almighty, holding our head down in shame. We cannot live a life where we are timid. Oh, glory be to God. We cannot live a life, oh, bless the name of Jesus, where we give up. Hallelujah. We cannot give up in life. Hallelujah. We must always understand that even if we find that we have an obstacle, we face an obstacle, glory be to God, we will always understand that God Almighty will find a way of escaping for us. And so therefore, we cannot fear. There is absolutely nothing that we should be fearful of. Amen. Glory be to God. And so therefore, glory be to God. We must hold our head up high. Yes, we'll go through some stuff. We will go through some rumbling, but glory be to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. We will, hallelujah, overcome. Glory be to God. Remember in the Lord's prayer, it tells us, oh, bless the name of Jesus, that though we walk to the valley of the shadow of death, that we shall fear no evil for the Lord is with us. Glory be to God. So he's telling us we should not be afraid. We cannot be afraid of some itsy bitsy things that may rise up against us. Sometimes, yes, it may seem hard. 
It may seem difficult. It may seem like there's something that will overtake us. But glory be to God, it is telling us that we cannot be afraid. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. It's telling us that we should not be afraid. Glory be to God. For God will come through for us. He will come through for us. Because guess what? He's going to fight our battle on our behalf. Glory be to God. He is going to take us through that situation. Glory be to come and we will overcome. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. We are an overcomer. Glory be to God because the greater one is inside of us. We are on the winning side. Glory be to God. And verse 2, it says, and it shall be when he come and, and nigh unto the battle that the priest shall approach and speak unto the people. Glory be to God. So it's telling you, hallelujah, when we approach, when we come near to the battle, then the priest shall approach and speak unto the people. It's telling us that glory be to God. What did the church is in presence? Whenever we are going through a situation, those that are in position must be ready to warn you. Hallelujah. Those are must be in ready, in position to direct you, to give you the word which the Lord will send forth through them. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. For he says he will not leave us comfortless. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. He will not leave us comfortless. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. So therefore, he says that he will give angels charge over us to keep us in our way. So glory be to God. The priest is the pastors, those that are in charge. Glory be to God in the house of God. Mighty God. And it also can be the angels that will visit you in a dreams and in visions. Glory be to God. Will also give you a word. Hallelujah. Glory be to God to warn you of your direction. This can also, you might call it an unch. Hallelujah. When you feel like you got an unch and you feel that unch that you should not go in that direction, but you should go in this direction. Glory be to God. That's the presence of God. The angels of the Lord ministering unto you. The ministering angels that will guide you. The ministering angels that will protect you. Why? Because you are are on the winning side. Glory be to God. The enemy will not be able to triumph over your life. You are on the winning side. And so therefore he will watch over you. He will guide you. He will protect you. He will lead you. Bless the name of the Lord Jesus. He will give you a word in the right moment, in the right season. Ah, glory be to God. So when the questions come, hallelujah, he will give you the answer answer how you are to respond in the time of your situation, in the time of your battle. Glory be to God. And so therefore we must hallelujah, glory be to God, be in the position where we lift up our faith unto God and be ready at all times to hear what he is saying unto us because God Almighty do speak unto us. Hallelujah. And so he will tell us, hallelujah, glory be to God, the next turn. Now God God, the next move. Oh, glory be to God. How oh, far should we go? Hallelujah. Bless the name of Jesus. And so therefore it says that the priest shall approach and speak unto the people. Glory be to God. How many of you know that there are ministering angels? Hallelujah. Glory be to God. They are the priestly ministering angels that will come and, me and, and, and speak unto you. They will tell you, hallelujah, glory be to God. You will feel that, that, that you call it a nudge in your spirit that you know what you're saying, you're going that way. But guess what? I don't feel like going there again. Hallelujah. I don't want to go in that direction anymore. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. Jesus, I feel like I should go into the next direction. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. It tells you, hallelujah, take not that bus, take the next one after. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. You may hear in your spirit, guess what? Hallelujah. Don't go up the road, turn down the road, do the left, do the right. Glory be to God. That's the angels giving you directions. Hallelujah. Bless the name of the Lord Jesus. You are on the winning side. He will protect you in everything that you do. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. God will protect you. 
He will protect you as long as you are in him. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. There will always be protection. Hallelujah. Over your life. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. And shall and, and verse three says, and shall and shall say and shall say unto them, Hear, O Israel. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. You can take that, O Israel, out and put your name there. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hear, O Sophia. He approached this day unto battle against your enemies. Let not your heart faint. Fear not and do not tremble, neither be ye terrified because of them. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. These are the words that you will spoke unto you. Hallelujah. You know, sometimes when somebody come up against you and when they rise up against you in such a way, you can hear the voices in your ears and you know what? Don't answer. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Do not respond. Hallelujah. Don't get angry. Hallelujah. Don't fight back. Mighty God of Daniel, that's the ministering priest angel ministering unto you, telling you divine instruction. Oh, glory be to God. You will hear walk away. Mighty God of Daniel, do not say a word and try as you might. you find that you cannot open your mouth because guess what? They put a lockdown on that mouth. Glory be to God. That's because you are on the winning side and the Lord will not allow you to say anything that will incriminate you. He will not allow you to say anything that will go up against you. He will not allow you to do anything that the enemy can use to charge against you. Why? Because God Almighty will keep you in all your ways. Glory be to God. He will not cause you to kick your foot against a stone. Bless the name of Jesus. So therefore, the ministering angels will come and minister to you. Bless the name of Jesus. It says, though the battle, oh glory be to God, is against um, our God Almighty. Though it says, oh, he approached this day unto battle against your enemies. Hallelujah. It says, let not your heart faint. Oh, glory be to God. Let not your heart faint. Do not let all oh, glory be to your God. You get weak. Do not get timid. Do not be afraid. My God Almighty, do not, oh, bless the name of Jesus, show fear on your face. My God, do not begin to bow down your head. My God, do not begin to, oh, God, surrender to your enemies. Hallelujah. Bless the name of Jesus. Why? Because God will fight your battle on you your behalf. So you show no sign of weakness. And you know, I used to hear the constantly saying this word, do not let your enemies see your tears. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Do not let your enemies see your weaknesses. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Do not go. God Almighty ready to be in defeat. God Almighty before your enemy. Do not, God Almighty crawl up. Oh, glory be to God in the bed. Oh, bless the name of Jesus in a fetus position that shows, oh God Almighty, depressions. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. It shows that uh, you are timid. It shows that you are weak. It shows that there is resentment. Glory be to God. But I want you all to understand uh, that the word of God says uh, that you must not be faint, that you must not be weak, that you must not be terrified because you are on the winning side. And it doesn't matter what the enemy want to say or what they want to do against your glory be to God. You are on the winning side. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And you will win. You will overcome. Glory be to God. The enemy will not be able to celebrate over your head. Bless the name of Jesus because you are on the winning side. Mighty God of Daniel, it doesn't matter what the enemy, oh glory be to God, want to pull up against you. It doesn't matter what record the enemy wants to bring up against you. It doesn't matter. Oh, glory be to God. The things of the past, what the enemy wants to try for and to bring against you. But I want you to know, glory be to God, as long as you are in Christ Jesus. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. The battle
battle is not yours, but it is the Lord. Bless the name of Jesus, and he will fight on your behalf. In the mighty name of Jesus, you are an overcomer. Oh, glory be to God, because greater is he that is in you than he that is in the world. You are on the winning side. Bless the name of Jesus. You will overcome. Oh, bless the name of the Lord. Glory be to God. It doesn't matter, Almighty oh, God of Daniel, what they, what the records they want to bring. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. It doesn't matter. Oh, glory be to God. Where they want to bring up your past, they want to bring up the things that you used to do. Bless the name of Jesus. It doesn't matter what they want to, they want to write. Oh, glory be to God against you, Mighty God. It doesn't matter what the statement that they want to bring. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. You are on the winning side. Bless the name name of Jesus. You are protected by God. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. My God Almighty, it doesn't matter how hot the battle is that rise up against you. Mighty God of Daniel, but I want you to know you are on the winning side. Oh, bless the name of Jesus and you will win. You will win. You will win. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. You will win. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. So verse 4 says, for the Lord your God, he is he that goeth with you to fight for you against your enemies to save you. Glory be to God. The Lord your God is he that goeth with you to fight for you against your enemies to save you. You are important to God. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. You are the apple of God high. Uh, bless the name of Jesus. Uh, so it doesn't matter which way the enemy want to come up against you. My God, they will come one way, uh, but they will flee seven different ways uh, because God will fight uh, on your behalf. Uh, he will fight uh, your battle for you. Uh, glory be to God. It is God himself, uh, the Lord God that goeth with you uh, to fight your battle, your enemies uh, and your enemies to save you. So my God, it doesn't matter what they bring up against you. When they bring up uh, something against you, my God Almighty will bring a word uh, to erase that out of the system, uh, to erase it out of the mouth of the enemy. And they look at you some type of way. But that, guess what? Uh, the same one will have to come back uh, and celebrate you in the mighty name of Jesus uh, because you are important to God. Uh, oh, bless the name of Jesus. You are important important to God. God have a purpose for your life. Bless the name of Jesus. I'm telling you that God had a purpose for your life. He did not create you just so you to occupy the earth. My God, there is purpose. Oh, glory be to God that God has for you in the mighty name of Jesus. There is purpose for your life. Bless the name of Jesus. You're not just here to occupy earth. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. There is a purpose for you here on earth. Glory be to God. And that purpose must be fulfilled. Glory be to God. It doesn't matter what the enemy says. Hallelujah. It doesn't matter what the enemy says. Hallelujah. But purpose must be fulfilled. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Glory be to God. Purpose must be fulfilled. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Purpose must be fulfilled. Glory be to God. Purpose must be fulfilled. And it doesn't matter how much they come up against you. Glory be to God. But purpose must be fulfilled. Bless the name of the Lord Jesus. And so therefore in 1 Chronicles 29 verse 11, it says, Thine, O Lord, is the, great, the greatness and the power and the glory and the victory and the majesty for all that is in heaven and in earth is thine. thine Thine is the kingdom, O God, O Lord, and, and thou art exalted as, as it above all. Mighty God of Daniel. What did it say? Oh, bless the name of Jesus. It said, Oh Lord, is the greatness. Hallelujah. In and the power and the glory and the victory and the majesty for all that is in heaven and in the earth. It tells in you that your glory be to God, that heaven and earth belongs to God. Everything that is in it, hallelujah, he is con in control of everything. Bless the name of Jesus. And thine is the kingdom.
kingdom, O Lord. Oh, bless the name of the Lord Jesus. And thou art exalted as head above all. That means he is above the head of everything. So he can change decision. He can turn things around. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. So it doesn't matter what case that they put before the judge. My God, I have a right to step before that judge. And any decision that that judge want to make, God is able to turn it around. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. It doesn't matter what profile, they want to profile you with. Glory be to God. We serve a God that can change that profile and turn it around for his glory. Oh, bless the name of the Lord Jesus. We serve the God that is in control of everything on earth and in heaven. So it doesn't matter what altar the enemy has built up against you. We serve a God that can overturn that altar. Mighty God of Daniel is telling you that God is in control of every situation and every attack against your life, every attack against your family, every attack against your children, every attack against your finance, every attack against your marriage, every attack against your ministry. God Almighty is in control and he is able to do exceedingly above all that we can ever ask or think. My God is able to overturn any blockage, any obstacle, any arrow. Oh, glory be to God that the enemy has thrown out against you. We are on the winning side and we will win. Bless the name of the Lord Jesus. Glory be to God. When you are on the winning side, my God and my King, you will always have a praise. You will always be able to worship God because he will come through for you. Bless the name of Jesus. The enemy may slow you down, but I'm telling you, glory be to God. Our God of divine speed will put our oh God Almighty a pet back in our step and we will get back to the rightful position where we can go back again and do exceedingly abundantly above all that we can ever ask or think. My God, we are on the winning side. We are in a position that we must win. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. My God, Philippians 4.13 says it. I can do all things through Christ which strengthens me. Oh, glory be to God. So it tells you that it doesn't matter what the enemy threw at you. Glory be to God. Whether it want to be sickness, weakness, or whatever it is that the enemy threw at you. You can do all things through Christ which strengthened you. And so therefore nothing by no means stand in your way. Glory be to God. You are an overcomer and you will win. Bless the name of the Lord Jesus. Glory be to God. You are an overcomer. You will win. Bless the name of the Lord Jesus. It doesn't matter how the enemy come against you. Oh, they fight against you. Oh, bless the name and they apply depression, causing you to forget stuff. My God Almighty causing you to think so much that you have all these sorts of headache. My God Almighty and the tempest rise against you that sometimes some people think about committing suicide. But I want to tell you something tonight. Don't let the devil win. The devil cannot win because God has given you a purpose and the reason why he's allowing you to go through that situation is because he wants you to build spiritual muscle. Do not quit. Do not take your life. Do not pop out. My God, do not tap out. My God Almighty, God is about to use you. That is a testimony for someone to cover breakthrough. Do not take those spills. Do not drink that liquid. Bless the name of the Lord Jesus. My God, do not put that rope around your neck. Do not run before the train. Don't jump off that bridge because it's not over yet. Once there is life, there is hope. God will fight that battle on your behalf. Oh, glory be to God. He is not left you alone. You are not there all by yourself and he will not leave you comfortless. I'm telling you that the Lord is still with you. It may seem like the oh God Almighty that the water is about to cover you up, but I'm telling you, Lord God Almighty, that God is there in the midst with you. Bless the name of the Lord Jesus. 
He is there to fight that battle on your behalf and you will come out on top. There will be an explosion and you will not be the one to go down. I'm telling you, do not pop out. Do not tap out. Don't give up. Don't throw in the towel. Mighty God of Daniel, God is ready to fight that battle on your behalf. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. My God, it seems a bit harsh. It seems tough. My God, I can feel your pain. But I'm telling you tonight that God is about to fight your battle. Lord God Almighty, I'm telling you, Lazarus had to go into the tomb. Lazarus has to go to be a, and be a dead man. He has to be filled to stink for God to get the glory. So you see a situation. It looks like it's about to take you out. But I'm telling you something, my brother, my sister, don't give up. Don't throw in the towel because God is going to do something exceedingly above all that you can ever ask or think so that he can get the glory out of your situation. Glory be to God. Hallelujah, glory be to God, he's calling you. Hallelujah, the Lord is calling you. He call you by your name. He call you by your number. My God Almighty, he, he, he sent angels to invite you to the church. He sent angels to invite you to the crusade, to the meetings. Glory be to God, but because of situations, my God and my King, you, you, you find every excuse in the book that why you couldn't go, and this thing is bothering you, it's bugging you. God Almighty is messing with your mind. Hallelujah. It's messing with your peace. My God Almighty. And that is the reason why God allowed the invitation for you to go forth. But anyway, you did not go. My God. My God will go the extra mile of the way. For this is the reason why he is allowing you to hear the service in the name of Jesus. Because God is an untimed God. And he is ready to come through for you. And so glory be to God. He has given you this chance so that you can reach up, oh God Almighty Lord Jesus, your hands unto him, so he can take you by your hands and tell you what he wants to tell you. I'm telling you, you are on the winning side. As long as there is breath, oh God Almighty, as long as there is life, there is hope. You are on the winning side. Glory be to God. It doesn't matter how they surround you. It doesn't matter how many witnesses they have against you. You are on the winning side. Bless the name of the Lord Jesus. Glory be to God. You are on the winning side. Hallelujah. First Corinthians 10, 13, it says, there are no temptation taking you, but such is the is common to man. But God is faithful we will not suffer you to be tempted above that ye are able, but will with the temptation also make a way to escape that he may be able to bear it. Glory be to God. God will allow you to help you. Oh God, find a way to escape for you to be able to bear this because guess what? God is going to send an angel. Oh, glory be to God to walk you through this situation. God is going to send you an angel. Oh, God to deliver you out of this situation. God is going to send you an angel. Oh, glory be to God to be there with you in your time of need. You are on the winning side. God cares about you and you will win. Oh, bless the name of the Lord Jesus. My God Almighty, it doesn't matter what the enemy want to say, what they want to cook up, what they want to plot, what they want to come and our oh God Almighty coincide and to, to plot against you and to bring the false witnesses, oh God Almighty, to go up against you, my God, to end, oh God, to turn, oh God Almighty, the things that you, you may put up, oh God Almighty, to turn it up against you, my God Almighty, and to misinterpret your words for something else, my God Almighty, Lord Jesus, it will be there with you to deliver you out of that situation, you are on the winning side, oh bless the name of the Lord Jesus, you will win. You will win. You are on the winning side. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. It doesn't matter what the enemy come up against you with. You will win. You will win. You will win. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Romans 30 and uh, Romans 8 from um, verse 36 to 39. He says, and it is written. Glory be to God. 
it is written, bless the name of Jesus, my God. For thy sake, we are killed all the day long. We are counted as sheep for the slaughter, my God. This is something that has been written. These things will come against you. These things will happen. You are counted as sheep to the slaughter. That simple means you are counted to all God Almighty to attacks to come at you every day. Once the Lord has given you an anointing upon your life, he has called you forth and he gives you a gift. My God Almighty, and you are burnt with that gift. Expect attack. Expect them to come against you. Expect them to should come against you without you doing anything. My God Almighty, expect enemies to rise up against you. Glory be to God. Expect anything. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. Why? Oh, mighty God, it is written. My God Almighty, it is written, it is written. For thy sake, we are killed all day long. Hallelujah. We are counted as sheep for the slaughter. Hallelujah. God Almighty, they're bound to attack you. They're bound to come up against you. They're bound to tell lie on you. They're bound to want to gang up on you. They're bound to want to say all sorts of manner of evil against you. They're bound to find fingers at you. Glory be to God Almighty. But you are an overcomer. Oh, mighty God. But this word of God says, Church of Seven says, Nay, in all these things, we are more than conquerors through Him that love us. We will overcome. We will overcome. Hallelujah. We will overcome. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. In all things, we are more than conqueror. We are more than conqueror through him that love us. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. 38 says, for I am persuaded that neither death, nor life, nor angels, nor principalities, nor powers, nor things present, nor things to come. 39, nor height, nor depth, nor any other creature shall be able to separate us from the love of God, which is in Christ our Lord. Glory be to God. God loves you. God loves you. Glory be to God. And nothing, hallelujah, oh, glory be to God, can separate you from the love of God. No evil altar, no demon, no voodoo priest, no witchcraft, no witch, no wizard, no warlock. Mighty God can come up against you. They cannot separate you from the love of God. Mighty God of Daniel, no accident, no death, mighty God Almighty, no gunman, no life man, no thief cannot separate you from the love of God. Doesn't matter what they do. They cannot separate you from the love of God. You are loved by God. You are on the winning side. Oh, glory be to God. You are more than conqueror. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. You are more than conqueror. You will win. Hallelujah. You are on the winning side. Oh, glory be to God. Because it says greater is he that is in you than he that is in the world. You are on the winning side. Mighty God, you are on the winning side. He will send you comforter to comfort you in all in your in all your ways so you will dash your foot you will gash your foot against a stone oh glory be to god my god almighty it doesn't matter the blockage they want to put in your way the stumbling block they want to put in your way the traps they want to set for you oh glory be to god the lies they want to sell on you the propaganda they want to build up against you but glory be to god you are loved by god and you are on the winning side you are more than a conqueror through christ jesus Jesus who loves you. Glory be to God. I'm telling you, you are more than a conqueror. Glory be to God. Second Chronicles 20, 15, uh, God Almighty, and verse 15, it says, and he says, I can eat all Judah and all ye inhabitants of Jerusalem, and thou King Jehoshaphat, thus said the Lord unto you, be not afraid nor dismay by reason of this great multitude, for the battle is not yours, but God's. Hey, glory be to God. The battle is not yours. Hallelujah. It will fall it will come glory be to God it will rise against you but the battle is not yours but the Lord's amen glory be to God 
God is able to do exceedingly above all that we can ever ask or think. He loves us so much that he laid on his life for our, the, the life of his son on our behalf. Glory be to God. He laid on his life. Hallelujah for us. Hallelujah. He came into this world to experience what we will go through, what we are go we're going through. And he set a president. Hallelujah. Glory be to God that you too can follow after the trend. He set that trend. Hallelujah. So you can follow that trend. He showed you how to get out of them. Some fight. You have to run away from it. Some of it you have to hide from it. Some of it you have to shut the door. Some of it you have to shut the gate. Oh, glory be to God. You don't want to hear it. My God, some of it, you have to move tone. You have to shift up yourself. You have to leave from where you're at and go somewhere else. My God Almighty, sometimes when the carpus is so hot, you have to tap out and take some time out and go somewhere else. My God, somewhere where you can get built up. Somewhere you can be relieved. Somewhere where the, oh, glory be to God, this heavy burden and the stress can roll off of you. My God and my King, sometimes you have to move from, from some place where you're at. My God Almighty, sometimes you have to get some rejection so that you can be protected because God wants to protect you from the hands of the enemy. And so therefore, he will find a way to escape. It may look foolish unto others, but I want you all to know that when God is doing something, he knows how to do it and he do it very well. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. God have a way how to work things out. Mighty God of Daniel, he have a way how to do things things that it seems stupid unto man, but glory be to God. Oh my God, it's foolish to man. But there is grace into it unto God. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. My God, as long as, oh, mighty God of Daniel, the Lord tell you to do it and to shift and to move direction. You better move. You better shift up because God Almighty is just delivering you out of something. He is just taking you out of a pit, out of a mess, out of a trap. And it may look silly. It may look that like you will be losing some stuff. But let me tell you something. When you lose those stuff, my God, him have a great a thing in store for you and therefore God Almighty will build up a greater thing uh, that you can get greater in store uh, because let me tell you something if God say you're going to eat ripe banana he's not going to stuff your mouth with a green one uh, oh bless the name of Jesus uh, if God says you're going to have pearls and diamond uh, my God Almighty is not going to give you a glass uh, my God Almighty is not going to give you a piece of chip uh, my God Almighty Lord Jesus uh, he's going to give you exactly what he says you're going to get uh, my God God, what you are supposed to get. My God, he said, if you get a mansion, he's not going to give you a one room. Oh, glory be to God Almighty. If he said you're going to have a family, my God Almighty, even if you have to adopt them, you're going to get the family. Glory be to God, because there's many ways to get a family, because sometimes you're born in some family, and it doesn't work out. But when you take up some stranger, the treat you better than your family. So I'm telling you, saints of God, it doesn't matter the way, oh, God want to do it. But God says he's to do something he is going to do it just trust him man oh god believe in him man believe that he will come true for you even in the ninth hour god is going to come true for you god is going to open up doors so you that no man can shut you think he bring it this far to leave or forsake you you think he take it this far to say oh glory be to god this one does not worthy of the blessing no he did not bring it this far to leave and not forsake you he has a way to turn things around at the ninth hour, Shando Messiah, glory be to God. You just have to trust him. You just got to trust him. Glory be to God. It says it doesn't matter. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. The multitude, the battle is not yours. It's God. So God Almighty know how it will end. He will know what you will go through. He will know what you will experience. He will know what the enemy will want to come up against you with or say against you. But glory be to God. Just stay. Hallelujah. Glory be to God on the fire and line. Hallelujah. Stay on the praise line. Stay on the, on, on the worship line. Stay on the prayer line. Glory be to God. Trust in your prayers unto God. Trust in the word that he has given to you. Trust the vision that he gives you and he speaks to you in the dreams and the vision. Glory be to God. He speaks. Hallelujah. And he loves you. He cares for you. Hallelujah. We are on the winning side Glory be to God. 
when Moses, hallelujah, glory be to God, lead these people out of Egypt, glory be to God almighty. Jesus, when they when when he see all these things that was happening and the fear of the people and all they come and they and they, 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 they pull on Moses and, and, and Moses get upset at times. But when he see the ultimate miracle, when he get to the Red Sea, glory be to God, Moses sang, ah, God Almighty, Moses sang a song. Glory be to God. It says here in Exodus 15 from 1 to 3, and it can continue with the with Exodus um, 15 to the end, to the 27th verse, and you will see, hallelujah, from the beginning to the end, you will see, hallelujah, glory be to God, I think until 21, that's where the, um, the song stopped, hallelujah, you will see how the song that me, uh, that Moses sang, and then, and then, um, Miriam took out a tambourine. It is in the song. Miriam um, uh, um, gift was birth. She that's when she knew her place to be a, a, a choir star, to be the lead the people in choir into singing. Hallelujah. Beating that tambourine. Hallelujah. Glory be to God in music, telling them to encouraging the people to sing. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. It was right in that period, Miriam, um, 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 gift was birth, given birth in, in, in Exodus 15, when she knew her place, glory be to God, it says here, then I sang Moses and the children of Israel, this song unto the Lord and spake saying, I will sing unto the Lord for he had triumphed gloriously. The horse and his rider are thrown into the sea. The Lord is my strength and song and he is become my salvation. He is my God and I will prepare him an habitation, my father's house and I will exalt him. The Lord is a man of war. The Lord is is his name. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. I tell you, you can continue there in Exodus 15. Glory be to God. That song that Moses sang. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. He sing and he speak. He told he sing and he speak. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Why? Because God has done our God Almighty the ultimate thing. When they thought that they did not have any way, God Almighty opened up the Red Sea and ushered them across that sea on a dry land. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. My God lead them, oh God Almighty, with the fire by, and the cloud by day, and the fire by night, my God Almighty, he put the cloud, and the fire, and he intersected, my God and my King, I'm telling you, God have a way to make a way of escape, and to lead you out of some situation, to lead you out of some stuff, that seems tough, and some stuff, that seems difficult, God have a way to lead you out of it, to open up doors that no man can shut, God have a way, oh glory be to God, to cast that red sea to flow upon the riders uh, oh god almighty the army and to take them out uh, my god almighty god almighty lord jesus have a way oh god almighty to deliver you out of the hands of the enemy my god almighty he have a way oh bless the name of jesus another thing that moses had to do was to lift the rod uh, and long as his hand was up uh, my god almighty the battle was won oh bless the name of jesus so sometimes you have to get somebody to hold up the hand uh, my god and my king but as long as your hands are open, you surrender unto God. As long as you surrender unto him, oh, bless the name of Jesus, then you will win the battle. Give it all to Jesus, the author and the finisher of your theater. As long as you depend upon him, he will fight the battle, the good fight, the battle of faith for you. My God, let your faith rise. Let your faith rise. Allow your faith to rise. Lift up your faith, man. Believe in your prayer that you pray. Yes, man, sometimes you have to wait some time, you know. You have to wait. Oh, glory be to God. So sometimes when you pray, my God Almighty, but wait patiently on him, no? Wait on him. Do not run before your time. Not because you're, oh, bless the name of Jesus. Don't. Wait.
Sister Sophie, I can't hear you. Jesus, hallelujah, thank you, Lord, thank you, thank you, bless the name of Jesus, hallelujah, as we were saying, glory be to God, do not allow the enemy, hallelujah, glory be to God, to ride upon you, hallelujah, for you to miss the blessing by troubling your emotion, to let you know, feel some type of fear, because the enemy come to kill, steal, and destroy, but God says, yeah, come that we might have life, and have it more abundantly, I'm telling you, so D is the only thing that is before anger, oh, glory, Glory be to God and D. When you put D upon D and anger, it comes danger. Oh, glory be to God. So I'm telling you how dangerous the enemy is. My God Almighty, to mess with your emotions, want to mess with the way how you feel sometimes and to cause it to get angry. When he hit off that D, he caused it to be angry. He wanted to be frustrated. He wanted to let you feel like you want to give up. He let you feel like you want to just do all sorts of things. You want to take off somebody. But I'm telling you, glory be to God, sometimes you got to bite that lip uh, and clinch that teeth and walk away. Glory be to God. Uh, show no impression to the enemy. Do not let the enemy see your weakness because that's what they use uh, to try to intimidate you. But glory be to God. I'm telling you that God, as long as you surrender unto God, the enemy will not be able to overthrow you. Glory be to God. You will be able to sing like Moses. Uh, glory be to God. Just surrender unto him. Surrender your life unto God and allow God to fight on your behalf because he will fight the good fight on your behalf. Glory be to God. John 16, 33 sings, it says, Jesus says, these things I have spoken unto you, that in me ye might have peace in the world, ye shall have tribulation, but be of good cheer, I have overcome the world. I'm telling you, God himself, Jesus, set the president for you. Glory be to God. He is telling you that he has overcome the world so you will have peace in him but in the world you will have tribulations i'm telling you when you go out there in the world the world have nothing good to teach you they will tell you all the slangs ah god almighty and the code word to speak that will cause you to get into trouble but when you go into the presence of god and you surrender unto god i'm telling you that god almighty himself will teach you how to praise he will teach you how to worship he will teach you how to move wisely. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. He will give you peace and tranquility. My God, you will have meekness. Oh, glory be to God. You will able to have everything in this world as long as you stay in him. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. He already set that president that as long as you stay in him, you gonna have peace. But if you're oh, glory be to God. If you are in and out and you are dilly-dallying, mighty God of Daniel, you are double-minded and you are contradictory. That means you are lukewarm and he said he will Spew you out, my God and my King. So if you don't want the Lord to spew you out, it's either you're in or you're out. But as long as you are in him, you will experience peace. Yes, situation want to rise up against you, but you know the word to apply to that situation and you will overcome. God has not bringing you this far to cause you to drown. He has not bringing you this far for you to tap out, to give up. Oh, God Almighty, to surrender to your enemy. My God, no. My God, he has another plan for your life and he will do it. It will come through for you. Our glory be to God. And 2 Corinthians 2, 14, it says, no, thanks be unto God, which always causes us to triumph in Christ and make it manifest the savior of his knowledge by us in every place. That simple means anywhere you go and the enemy want to come up against you, you will triumph in Christ. My God, Almighty, even if you go before the king, as long as you are in Christ, God will cause you to triumph because God can change the decision of the king. Glory be to God if they put you in the jailhouse. My God Almighty, and God says it's time for you to come out as long as you are in Christ Jesus and you believe in him in all your heart and lean not on your own understanding. He will cause the case to just recall and cast the 
world to let you out uh, and let you out in such a way that they cannot recall it back. Uh, uh, glory be to God. And even if they call it back, uh, my God will cast an escape. Uh, my God Almighty, because let me tell you something, the enemy has to try his thing. Uh, if they don't try their thing, uh, they're not doing their duty, but you just got to have faith. Uh, have faith as small as a mustard seed. Uh, you will overcome. You are more than conqueror. Christ loves you. Oh, glory be to God. He loves you. Mighty God, he loves you. You are on the winning side. Glory be to God. You are on the winning side. You are on the winning side. Glory be to God. You are on the winning side. Bless the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. You are on the winning side. It doesn't matter where you're at. Mighty God, it doesn't matter where you're at. It says that, oh, glory be to God. Give thanks unto God, which always cause it us to triumph in Christ. Hallelujah. Glory be to God and make it manifest the savior of his knowledge by us in every place, in every place, in everywhere. Oh, glory be to God. Even if you go down into the, the, the pit of hell, oh, bless the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. He said he will be there. He will come in there. Hallelujah. He will deliver you from out of there. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. That simple means nothing can hold you down. As the songwriter said, no grave cannot hold his body down. No grave cannot hold your body down. No grave cannot dig you down. No grave cannot hold you down because God Almighty can go enter anywhere and he will take you out oh bless the name of jesus we can give thanks unto god because he is a god that can go anywhere nothing is off limit for the god that we serve god almighty can go into any battle any situation any place it doesn't matter how small the space is he find a way to cause an escape glory be to god don't you understand the god that you serve that nothing is off limit for for him, he will come through for you. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. He will come through for you. He will come through for you. He will come through for you. Don't give up. Don't throw in the battle. He will come through for you. God is able to do exceedingly above all that we can ever ask or things. I'm telling you, saints of God, in any time a situation come up against you and you apply the word of God unto it, I'm telling you that you just put life into that situation because the word of God is life. Hey, Bashanda Rabahai. The word of God is life. Hey, Mandushka Tarabahai. So you put the life of God in that situation. Oh, glory be to God. It tells you in 2 Tim Timothy, hallelujah, 4, verse 7 and 8. It says, I have fight a good fight. I have finished my course. I have kept the fate. Henceforth, there is laid up for me a crown of righteousness, which the Lord, the righteous judge, shall give me at that day. Day. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. And not to me only, but to, unto all them also that love is appearing. Glory be to God. I'm telling you, uh, God Almighty, I'm telling you that it is not only laid up. That crown is not only laid up for me alone. Uh, hallelujah. It was not laid up for only them alone. Uh, oh, glory be to God, the apostles alone. Uh, it was not laid up only for the pastors alone. Uh, it was not laid up, oh, God Almighty, for the kings and the queens alone. Uh, it has been laid up for all them. Uh, hallelujah. Glory be to God Almighty. All them that also that love is appearing hallelujah glory be to god so i'm telling you the crown of glory be to god of righteousness which the lord righteous shall judge is laid up for everyone every one of us oh god almighty will be a partaker oh glory be to god almighty of that crown hallelujah as long as you surrender unto him you will be a partaker of that crown hallelujah glory be to god it tells us hallelujah glory be to god in first corinthians 15 from 55 to 58 it says almighty oh, god almighty look at how our oh, god almighty god and make a mockery oh god almighty unto sin it says oh debt where is thy sting oh grave where is thy victory the sting of death is sin and the strength of sin is the law but thanks be to god which given us the victory through our lord jesus christ therefore my beloved brethren be 
is steadfast, unmovable, always abounding in the work of the Lord. For as much as we know that your labor is not in vain in the Lord. Oh, glory be to God. I'm telling you, when you do the work of the Lord, it's not in vain. Never will be in vain. Glory be to God. Mr. say, God has his reward with him, and he has it with him, and he takes it everywhere that he goeth, and he give it to whomever he chooses to give it. Glory be to God. The reward of God is with him. It's not in the hand of man. It is not in the hand of a child nor a woman. Glory be to God. It is with God. And as long as you surrender unto God, your reward is sure. As long as you do that which he has called you for to do, your reward is sure. Oh, glory be to God. Your crown in heaven is awaiting you. It is sure. Just continue to do that which God has called you for to do. Because you are on the winning side, oh, glory be to God. There's a, a scripture that says that there's a race that all has to run. Glory be to God. I will paraphrase it in my own words. Glory be to God. There is a race that all of us got to run. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. But only one person got to get the prize. And so if you want the prize, you got to run the race to get the prize. You have to run the race like it's you alone in the race and you must win it. Glory be to God. You got to run that race like your life depend upon it. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. There is a race that we all have to win. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. I'm going to tell you the saints of God, that race is the race to get into heaven uh, to make sure that you are called, uh, that your name is written in the Lamb Book of Life uh, and the reward is that you will receive your crown of glory, your crown of righteousness uh, there in heaven. So you better run this race because uh, your life depend upon it. Uh, your afterlife depend upon it. Uh, do what is right into the sight of God. Uh, do what is righteous and upright. Stand up in the gap where Jesus has placed you and make sure that you don't bow down to the folly of this world. Glory be to God. God is on of us on the winning side and he will fight our battle on our behalf. You must win. You got to win. Glory be to God because you got the Savior with you. Oh, bless the name of Jesus and he's greatly in uh, your inside of you and he will deliver you out of the ends of the enemy. It will cause a way for you to escape. Glory be to God. The race that we have to win is to get to heaven. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Not only by ourselves. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. But also to, for others. Hallelujah. Make ways for others. Make room for others that you can all win. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. I'm telling you, God is the only one can repay anyone, any amount, whenever he feel like. It doesn't matter where you started and how, how, how early you start or how late you start. If you want to start in the noon day, the part day, the evening. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. One hour before the race finish. Glory be to God. God will give you your reward. It is there. Hallelujah. Waiting for you. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. God has his reward with him and he gave it to whomever he chooses. There is absolutely no sin that is not be able to be pardoned except for blasphemy. Amen. Of the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. That is the only sin that cannot be pardoned blaspheming of the Holy Ghost. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. There is pardon for you. Glory be to God. Pardon is there for you. Hallelujah. Be ready to receive the Lord. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. I want you, if you're going through a situation right now and you need the Lord to enter into your life, Find a Bible belief church. Go and surrender your life unto him. Amen. Be baptized in the name of Jesus Christ for the remission of your sin. Hallelujah. God will deliver you. Run under the blood of Jesus. Go under the blood of Jesus. It doesn't matter what avalanche is coming down at you. Go under the blood of Jesus and the blood will be a shelter 
before you. Amen. The Lord is a strong tower. The righteous run into him and they are safe. Glory be to God. So run to the shelter of the Lord. Go be baptized in Jesus' name for the remission of your sin. For the remission is the removal of your sin. Hallelujah. Allow God to build that shelter over you to protect you. So it doesn't matter what come against you. God will come through for you. Divine access. Give your life to God. Surrender unto him and he will do it for you. Amen. Glory be to God at this point. I'll just open the floor for anyone who would like to share. Glory be to God. Give a testimony. Anything you'd like to share, please come forward. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Is there anyone who'd like to share? Bless the name of the Lord Jesus. Glory be to God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah, glory be to God. No one like to share. Hallelujah, glory be to God. Let's give the Lord thanks. Let's go into prayer. Hallelujah, glory be to God. Is that Petrina, you want to say something? Hi, everyone. Can you hear me? Yes, we can hear you now. Oh, sorry, because I'm driving while I'm listening. Amen. I just want to say such a powerful, powerful message. And that's you know, the message is, is so powerful and I too can partake and testify from the message. And, the, you know, the Bible verse says, they that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. They Amen. shall mount upon me wings as eagles. Amen. And I just want to say that God is moving in my life and I'm just grateful for this prior line Amen. that, you know, the blessings and the testimonies that is happening in my life. Amen. I'm doing a course at um, the university. Because when you're in there, you always have to do these courses. Amen. And I remember doing this research method, and it's one of the hardest, hardest, hardest essay one can do because it's so difficult. So you have to sign all these research papers. And we submitted the essay in, in May, and we were supposed to get the results in June. And when June come, the results didn't come, come out. It was supposed to come out the 18th of June. And it, they sent the email saying that it's going to come out the 25th of July. And on the 25th of July, some students got their results and some of us didn't. And it so happened that my results was one of the results that wasn't marked. And I got that email the same day that it was due saying that your, your paper hasn't been marked. Apologies. We will notify you. And I was like, my friend, also, one of my classmates, classmates, she also didn't get her smart. And she said she's going to, should we email them and stuff like that? That was before they send out the email to say that it was a mark before we got the grade. It, and they sent out the email to say, oh, work was a mark. She was saying, should we send out the email to them? And I said, nope. I said, God's got it all in control. I'm not sending any email. I'm leaving it to God. And saints of God, we must sometimes be patient. So what's the what how does it go? Slow to slow to anger. Mm -hmm. Slow to slow to anger. We mustn't be hasty, be anxious for nothing. Mm -hmm. And I said no, and then in we have a we have a WhatsApp group for all the persons, the two hundred and fifty persons within the within the nursing group. And some of them were either going to email, and some of them that got back the results, majority of them failed the paper. And I remember, I remember saying to to to, to my friend, most of them fail, and it seems to be this particular teacher that's failing most of them. And I started to pray. And I said, God, please don't let me come back with a failed assignment. Please, I can't resit this paper. And some of the persons, they were emailing and saying that they're going to appeal the grade. And I said, I'm waiting on God, waiting on God. I'm not emailing, I'm not doing anything. And they sent out an email that my work was a mark. And I was like, you know what? God has a plan. 
And for the fact that the parents, the teacher that marked some of those students, and most of them were really failing, in some, including some of my classmates, I started to pray and I said, God, if this gentleman that's failing these students get my essay, please, God, blind his eyes, send angels upon him that when he's marking my work, he sees everything that is supposed to be there in this essay. And I prayed and I put it in the hands of God. And I remember saying it to Minister Sophie as well. And we both said, wait and let God do what he's supposed to do. And today I got an email, you know, we're fasting for the, for, the, for the prayer thingy. I'm telling you guys, when you fast with this, with this, with this Zoom meeting on a Thursday, God does answer prayers. He does answer because you're coming in together as a unity. And I got an email from the university that your work is marked and your results are out. And my heart shrunk because I'm like, what am I going in there to look for? And I quick, quick log on to my, my city email um, account to see what is it that my grade was. And I passed with 65% and I was like, oh my God, the pass mark is 40% and I got 65%. And I was like, thank you, Jesus. I can now go on my holiday, enjoy myself, and know that I've completed this course and I've finished. I don't have nothing to worry about. And I say this to encourage somebody. Sometimes you don't get the results there and then. But wait on God and let God have full control. Wait and be patient upon God because once you serve him and you put your trust in him, he will deliver you. He will never, ever fail you. So I want to encourage you guys, don't be hasty for nothing. Don't be disheartened when you don't get what you want at the time that you want it. Don't be disheartened if you get a bad result. Don't be disheartened if it doesn't go the way you want. But put it in the hands of God. Trust and believe. And no matter how simple it is, the sum is just might be all if you fail to reset it. But to reset an essay is not easy. So I'm just saying, and we encourage my brothers and sisters and stay steadfast in God because he will answer your prayers. God bless you all. Amen. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Anyone else would like to testify or share something? Glory be to God. Anyone else? Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. When God say yes, no man can say Jesus. no. Amen. I have to give God thanks to wake up this morning. Could I worse? Amen. My throat has stick me from yesterday, but you know. Amen. I have to just beat pants on lime and honey and Amen. get a garlic. Amen. And just have to just give God thanks and just make God work in your flavor. Amen. Because when God tell her yes, auntie, nobody can tell her no. A minister will lift up. And we can feel it in my spirit. Amen. Glory in Jesus' name. Have a good night. Yeah, I'm here. Amen. God bless. Good night, Amen. everyone on the line. Good night. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. 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 God is good. Thank you, Jesus. Anyone else would like to share? Hallelujah, glory be to God. Anyone else? Good, good night, good night, good night. Good night. Hope everyone had a blessed, 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 blessed week. Hallelujah. Um, I have a testimony. You remember last week when I said that um the Lord moved in a mighty, mighty way? Amen. Well, I'll give you the rest of it. So the my partner my, well my husband thing did run out this year early this year so we put in the um the immigration thing for the um immigration we put it in in may but because it was running out in may anyway i didn't know that um because we use a lawyer so i didn't know that um immigration would text us that will text me someday one um there something i was in my room and something said to me um shh, papa something said to me go on your email so i said okay um let me check my email i don't know what i was checking for so i scrolled down and i see f 
F L R M or something like that. And I looked at it, I was like, what's this? Then it said, it come from immigration and that was from the 10th of June. And I was like, oh my God, we're not late. So anyway, so they said, they said I give another um, deadline saying that if we don't correspond, that like they send it on the 29th of June again, and I didn't see it. Then they send it on the 13th, say like the 14th was the last. And if we don't um, redo it, that means they would, um, they're not, taking it in consideration because they sent it a couple of times. Anyway, people of God, I was panicking. I found sister, so minister Stofi. I'm like, oh my God, I don't know what to do. And I started panicking and stuff like that. So anyway, me and I said, all right, we'll see. Well, we'll try, I'll try to send like send what they need, but they didn't need the part where I have, they needed a different part. And I was like, oh my gosh, what we're gonna do? So they need consent three consent to and another thing like an authorization thing and I didn't have it so anyway I emailed it to the lawyer that same time two o'clock in the morning and I was like oh my god what are we gonna do so anyway I couldn't even sleep that night so I um, phone I was phoning the lawyer but when I look at her email he's saying come and see me um come come and see me straight away so anyway we went and see him and then we well, I went and see him first, and then he wanted to see my husband. So anyway, we went now, and I was like, oh, my God, we're so late. What is going to happen? But people of God, when we send off everything, I say, all right, well, at least it's in the home office. So the next day, you now, the Friday. So that's the Thursday, you know. Then the Friday, you now, I, I wake up, I see a, a text from the lawyer saying, oh, um, call him. But I didn't call him. I said, let me go on the email. When I look on the email, people of God, mm. I'm telling you, this, the, the immigration people say, yes, they have, um, accepted it. And he got another two and a half year. Tell me if it's not God. Mm -hmm. I'm telling yeah. you, you have to believe and trust in God. Listen, mm -hmm. remember, we were late past deadline, everything, and I didn't even know. And I'm telling you, people yeah. of God, can you imagine? We yeah. went the Thursday. That time when prior line just started, you know, me just come back in tired, exhausted. I figured, oh my God, that time my mouth had whacked me behind, you know. <laughs> Although it's still whacking me, but I'm telling you, when I end up, go sleep that Friday, Thursday night and wake up and see a text from a lawyer. I'm like, whoa. Anyway, when I look, I got, he got another how much year. Listen, yeah, I for trusting a God. Listen, may I tell you, said this prior line, I go on with some things. We have to just trust and believe. Yes, we have to trust and believe people of God. We have to trust and believe. So look at that. So anybody who have immigration problem or anything, I'm telling you, we'll do a fasting, we'll do a praying, and we have to trust and believe, and it will happen. This Amen. is my few words, people of God. Glory be to God. Amen. Congratulations. <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. When God speak a word, it will come to pass. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Amen. I am standing in the gap for anyone else that are waiting for indefinite leave to remain. Are they waiting Amen. for um, status from the home office? who are waiting for the immigration to do anything for them. I'm standing in the gap for them that they too will also experience the move of God, the shift of God, that their foot are standing on the solid ground of that country, that area where they're at, and God will come through and grant them the status to remain in that country. Amen. God will also Amen. open the doors on their behalf in the mighty name of Jesus. They too will experience and have that experience to drink the milk and honey. Glory be to God and standing in a gap on their behalf in Jesus' name. And they too will experience and have that great experience. Whether you want to be in America, Canada, the United States of America, hallelujah. You want to be in the UK, Asia, wherever you're at, 
God will come through. Cayman Island, God will come through for you. You will have your status in Jesus' mighty name. Wherever you are in the world, God will come through. You're going to give God thanks. Wherever you are, according to the scripture that it has said unto us here, glory be to God. It says, hallelujah, in 2 Chronicles 2.14, Corinthians 2.14. Now, un, now thanks, un, um, thanks be unto God, which always causes us to triumph in Christ and make manifest the Savior of his knowledge by us in every place. So wherever you want to be in this world, glory be to God. I am standing in the gap that whatever it is that you are looking for, you, you, you want God to come into the midst for, that you too will also receive it. Your breakthrough is just around the corner. Hallelujah, glory be. I decree and declare by tomorrow, this time, you too shall testify in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 You too shall testify Amen. in the name Amen. of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Glory be Amen. to God. The door shall be open for you too in Jesus' mighty name. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Let us just go and sing our theme song. Anyone else would like to testify? Glory be to God. Give a word. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Final call for this evening. Glory be to God. Let us sing our theme song. Hallelujah. And go into prayer. Amen. Glory be to God. Thanks, thanks, we give you thanks for all you have done. I am so blessed, yes, my soul is at rest. Oh, Lord, we give you thanks, thanks, thanks. We give you thanks for all you have done. We are so blessed, yeah. Our soul is at rest, oh Lord, we give you thanks, one more time, thanks, thanks, we give you thanks for all you have done. We are so blessed, yes, our soul is at rest, oh Lord, we give you thanks, oh Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Ha, ah, God Almighty. I just feel so happy. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Just hear this song. Many are the blessings that He give unto me. Blessing overflowing that I'm meant to see. Lord, I want to thank you for your thoughts of me. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I want to thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for every little thought of me. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for every little thought of me. Many are the blessings that you give unto me. Blessing overflowing that I'm meant to see. Yeah. 
for your thoughts of me. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I want to thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for every little thought of me. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for every little thought of me. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for every little thought of me. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for every little thought of me. Thank you, Lord. Yes, thank you, Lord. For every little thought of me. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. For every little thought of me. Glory be to God. I am nothing but mere dust. But glory be to God. Your thought is on me. Glory be to God. I thank you, Jesus. I thank you, Lord. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. I'm just going to ask you for those that can unmute your mic. Hallelujah. Without any disturbance in your background. Let's please just do unmute right now so that we can pray. Hallelujah. We can go into prayer. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. We're just going to pray and go into prayer. Amen. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And we're going to take a first prayer point from Psalms 25 from verse 1 to 2. And it says, unto thee, O Lord, do I lift up my soul. O my God, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Let not my enemies triumph over me. Glory be to God. You will not be ashamed and your enemy will not triumph over you. You are on the winning side. Amen. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Lord God Almighty, unto you, Almighty God. Father, God Almighty, we lift up our souls. Oh, Father, God Almighty, Lord, Jesus and Father God Almighty, as we trust in thee, oh God, Father God Almighty, we pray, oh God Almighty, that Lord, we will not be ashamed, oh God Almighty, oh God Almighty, nor our enemies, oh God Almighty, shall be able to triumph over we go, God. For Lord God Almighty, you will hide us in your bosom, hide us in the cliff of the rock, hide us, oh God Almighty, Lord Jesus, under your blood, in the mighty name of Jesus. And so, Lord, we just want to thank you, glorify you, lift you up, and I, for you are worthy to be praised mighty God we thank you that Lord we can rest assured that we serve a God who never fails oh God almighty in the name of Jesus that you are the born in Gideon in the mighty name of Jesus mighty God Lord Jesus we understand that as long as we surrender unto you God almighty that Lord Jesus you will fight on our behalf in the mighty name of Jesus that Lord God almighty we have deliverance and the hope in you Christ Jesus father we thank Thank you for what you're about to do in our lives in the name of Jesus. We thank you that Father God Almighty that we may be able to do exceedingly above all that we can ever ask or think uh, as long as we trust in you Almighty God. Uh, Father God Almighty Lord Jesus there's no failure in you Father. Oh God Almighty we thank you for what you're about to do Father. We thank you that Lord Jesus our name oh God Almighty shall be written in the Lamb Book of Life in the mighty name of Jesus. Father God Almighty Lord, we glorify your name Lord Jesus and we lift you up on high for you are worthy to be praised. Mighty God and my King Lord, we pray oh God Almighty that you continue us oh Lord God Almighty be our hiding place Almighty God that you will hide us under the corporate of your wing oh God Almighty in the name of Jesus draw us closely unto you Father in the mighty name of Jesus. Father God Almighty oh Father that we are under your shadow of your wing that means we are closer to your heart uh, in the mighty name of Jesus that Lord God Almighty Lord you will embrace us uh, oh Father God Almighty that you will speak unto us uh, our God Almighty and to show us your love your grace your mercy and your truth uh, in the mighty name of Jesus we thank you Father God Almighty that our enemy will not be able to triumph over our life oh God Almighty but your grace uh, oh God Almighty which is sufficient for us oh God Father God Almighty will be 
upon us in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Lord, we thank you. Father, God Almighty, for the peace, oh God Almighty, in our lives, in our family, in our children. Father, God Almighty, in our finance, our work, our business, in the mighty name of Jesus. We thank you that, Lord God Almighty, that you are there, oh God Almighty, in the midst of us, in the mighty name of Jesus. We thank you that, Lord God Almighty, the enemy will not cause us, mighty God. There is no shame, oh God Almighty, in the game. Mighty God Almighty, as long as we surrender unto you, Father, oh God, the enemy will not triumph over us. My God Almighty, Lord Jesus, we will not be put to shame. We will not be cast down. We will not be trodden and we will not be trampled. Oh, Father God, we thank you and glorify your name because, Lord God Almighty, hope, oh God Almighty, is there in your life, is there in your peace, is there with you. In the mighty name of Jesus, as long as I stay at your feet and surrender under your will, my God Almighty, Lord, I know, God Almighty, that my life will never remain the same. And so, Father, we glorify your name and we lift you up on high in the mighty name of Jesus. We thank you that, Father, God Almighty Lord, that you will be over our recovery. Almighty God, to recover us. Mighty God, to redeem us. Father, God Almighty, to redeem us back unto you, Father. Father, God, to sharpen our prayer life. Oh, God Almighty, our spirit man, that he will come back alive with bounce back. Oh, Father, God Almighty, to be in good swing again in the mighty name of Jesus, and there shall be a replenishing. Oh, God Almighty, I turn around and change. In the mighty name of Jesus, Father God, I thank you, Lord God, for your loving kindness, which is better than life itself. My God and my King, Lord God Almighty, I thank you that you are the glory and the lifter up of my heads. In the mighty name of Jesus, Father God Almighty, I thank you that, Lord, you will glorify yourself, oh God Almighty, in us. In the mighty name of Jesus, my God Almighty, that you will open up doors for us that no man can shut. In the mighty name of Jesus, that Lord God Almighty, that you will be there in a twinkling of an eye. In the mighty name of Jesus, let the blood that speaks better things, oh God, watch over us, oh God Almighty, and to cover us. In the name of Jesus, my God and my King Lord, we pray, oh God Almighty, that you let your anointing of your Holy Spirit, oh God Almighty, hover over us, over, over our life, over, over our family, over, over our children, oh God, over over our finance, over over our job, oh God Almighty, our business, in the mighty name of Jesus, over over the ministry, over over our health, in the name of Jesus, mighty God, when you be the shelter, oh God Almighty, Lord Jesus, and be the wheel in the middle of the wheel, oh glory be to God, we know that we will be saved, and we shall stand strong, in the mighty name of Jesus, and the dunamis power shall be in the midst of us, in the name of Jesus, my God, we thank you, that Lord God Almighty, we will celebrate of your goodness, of your glory, of your love, your peace, your joy, your happiness in the mighty name of Jesus. So you shall make a way that there seems to be no way in the name of Jesus. My God, I thank you, God Almighty, that there shall be a lifted up in the name of Jesus. And our soul shall be lifted up from off the ground. Oh, God Almighty, Lord Jesus, for the enemy come to kill, steal, and destroy. But God just said, you have come that we shall have life and have it more abundantly in the mighty name of Jesus. So, Lord, we understand uh, that there shall be a triumph in you, mighty God, uh, in the name of Jesus. We shall triumph in your glory, in your praise, uh, in your honor, in your love. Uh, oh, mighty God, we thank you, oh God, uh, that you, oh God Almighty, shall be there, oh God, in the midst of our situation. And God, you will uphold us, oh God, with your mighty right hand uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. Because God Almighty, the hand of Rubu Babel, uh, oh God Almighty, Lord Jesus, that begin a good work uh, shall surely complete it to the very end uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. We thank you for your divine love. We thank you for your grace, your mercy, oh God. We thank you that truly, oh God Almighty, we shall rest uh, and abide in you, God, uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, that you shall be there with us in our times of need. Oh, Father God Almighty, that you will flung open the doors, oh God Almighty, that the enemy, oh God Almighty, try to shut in the name of Jesus. But God, I thank you that you are the keys. Oh, mighty God, oh God Almighty, that you are the head above every one of us. Oh, God Almighty, in heaven and in earth, in the name of Jesus. And so, Father God Almighty, nothing shall hold us back. Oh, God Almighty, nothing shall keep us into captivity. 
eternity in the name of Jesus because God Almighty, we serve a God who never fails. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. And so, Father, we can rejoice in you, God. We shall, we can rejoice in your love and your grace, in your truth, oh God Almighty, in the name of Jesus, because God Almighty, you are there with us in every area of our lives. And so, Father, we just want to thank you. We just want to lift you up. We just want to glorify your name. Oh, God Almighty, for you're worthy to be praised. Blessed be to the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Our next prayer point shall be in Psalms 145, verse 14. Glory be to God. And it says, uh, the Lord upholdeth all that fall and rises up all that, uh, that uh, all those that be bowed down. Glory be to God. Let me say that again. The Lord upholdeth all that fall and rises up, up all those that be bowed down. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Father, God Almighty, Lord, we just want to thank you. We just want to lift you up. We just want to glorify you. We just want to worship and adore you, Lord, God Almighty, Lord. Uh, because God Almighty, though the battle may be hot uh, and the tempest torn, uh, oh, God Almighty, don't rock in the road as we travel along. Uh, Father, God Almighty, our hope is in you. Uh, and we can hold on a little longer. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. Uh, because God Almighty, Lord, uh, you uphold all that fall uh, and rises up all uh, those that be bowed down. Uh, oh God Almighty, Lord Jesus, uh, those situations may come up against us uh, that we shall bend over. But God Almighty, Lord Jesus, uh, we thank you, Lord God Almighty, that your hands, your outstretched hands, uh, oh God, will lift us up uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, oh God Almighty, that you will keep us afloat uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, my God Almighty, that you, Lord God Almighty, you will wash us thoroughly in your precious blood. Uh. Father God, you will keep us clean. Uh. Oh God Almighty, from all harm, dust, and sneer. Uh. In the mighty name of Jesus. Uh. Because God Almighty, as we are the apple of your eyes, uh. my God Almighty, dear for God, you will brush off every dust. Uh. Oh God Almighty, oh, all of knees. Uh. In the mighty name of Jesus. Uh. My God, you will deliver us. Uh. Oh God Almighty, out of situation, oh God, that look tempest and torn. Uh. Oh Father God Almighty, we thank you that Lord Jesus. Uh. Lord God, you will hold it up us all. Oh God Almighty, when we fall on that, oh God Almighty, Lord Jesus, you will be there, God, to rise us up again in the name of Jesus, because you are the God of second chances in the mighty name of Jesus. So it doesn't matter the situation that we've been through, oh God Almighty, but that God Almighty, you will be there, God, to lift us up high above every circumstances in the mighty name of Jesus. My God Almighty, Lord Jesus, Though God Almighty, we may tumble and stumble, oh God Almighty, along the way. Uh, but God Almighty, Lord Jesus, uh, you Lord God, you will release your angels, oh God, to be, oh God Almighty, to keep us uh, in all our ways, oh God. Uh, my God Almighty, Lord Jesus, uh, you will send oh, God, yeah. help, uh, Lord God, uh, to help us, oh God Almighty, along the way. Uh, in the mighty name of Jesus, uh, my God Almighty, you will send forth a deliverer, Lord, uh, to deliver us along the way, Father. In the mighty name of Jesus. He will send forth a priest uh, with a word in his mouth uh, in the mighty name of Jesus uh, to speak unto us, Almighty God. Um, my God, Almighty Lord Jesus, you will come true by yourself uh, in the name of Jesus uh, and make a way with the seals of being aware. Uh, you will farm a way to escape uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, and so, Father God Almighty, we thank you that we can still, uh, God Almighty, depend upon you, God, uh, for you shall be there, Lord God Almighty, in our times of need uh, in the mighty name of Jesus, uh, mighty God, when we are weak, oh God, uh, you are dear, Lord God Almighty, you are strong uh, in the mighty name of Jesus, uh, uh, God Almighty, and when we are strong, uh, Lord, you cause us to be stronger again uh, in the mighty name of Jesus, uh, you tap us up again, uh, so that means, oh God Almighty, Lord, uh, we shall not go weary in our dim, uh, oh Father God Almighty, we thank you that Lord Jesus, uh, our trust and our hope uh, is in you, God Almighty, in the mighty name of Jesus, uh, and so Father God Almighty, Lord, we prayer. Oh, God Almighty, Lord Jesus, uh, you will go the Allah's uh, mile of the way, Lord God Almighty, on our behalf, Father God, uh, for wherever we are, Lord Jesus, uh, you will always be there with us uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, and so, Father God Almighty, I thank you that every blockage, oh God, uh, every stumbling block, uh, every cyst in the body, Father God Almighty, Lord Jesus, uh, you, God Almighty, will be the operator in the room uh, in the name of Jesus. Almighty oh, God, I thank you for the turn around the change. Uh, mighty God, 
somebody even in the hospital, mighty God, you will be the doctor, you will be the nurse, you will be the health maid, oh Father God Almighty, the assistant, the comforter, my God, the guidance, oh Father God Almighty, Lord Jesus, in the jealous Almighty God, you will be there, the minister, minister unto the souls, oh God Almighty, of those that are lost, in the mighty name of Jesus, because God Almighty God, you can do jailbreak, oh God Almighty, Lord Jesus, you can do deliverance, in the name of Jesus, you can open the eyes of the blind, oh God, open the ears of the deaf, Father God, you can open the mouth of the dumb, oh bless the name of Jesus, oh Father God Almighty, you can rise up, those that are crippled, oh God Almighty, and weak, my God Almighty, Lord Jesus, for those that are bedridden, my God Almighty, you are able to pick them up, oh God, in the name of Jesus, and there shall be deliverance, oh God, you shall comfort them, in the name of Jesus, my God and my King, Lord God, you are able to do exceedingly abundantly above all that we can ever ask or think. Father God Almighty, Lord Jesus, you are the God of signs, miracles, and wonders. In the mighty name of Jesus, my God and my King, you can do all things in the name of Jesus. As a Lord, we just want to thank you and we want to glorify your name in the name of Jesus because God Almighty, you are never too tired, you are never too weary, you are never too broken down. Oh God Almighty, to uphold all that fall in the mighty name of Jesus and to rise up all that those that are bowed down my God and mighty Lord Jesus you are never tired of hearing a voice in the name of Jesus you are never tired to hear a complain in the mighty name of Jesus you are never tired to hear we are doubt in the name of Jesus you are never tired to hear that when we are weary in the name of Jesus and so Father God Almighty I just want to thank you oh glory be to God that you are a safety net and that you will always be there with us in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, glory be to God. My God and my King, Lord. Lord, I just want to thank you. Oh, God Almighty, I just want to bless your name, Lord, for your good and your mercy endure it forever in the mighty name of Jesus. Our Lord, God Almighty, Lord, when I needed your peace, Almighty God, you shall be there. Oh, God Almighty, Lord Jesus, when I need a little laughter, God, you shall show up uh, in the mighty name of Jesus, uh, my God and my King Lord. Uh, when I need a resting place, uh, my God Almighty, you will be there on point uh, in the mighty name of Jesus, uh, my God and my King Lord God, uh, Lord Jesus. Uh, when I need to lean on someone, uh, oh glory be to God, uh, you will forever be dear Lord, uh, Father God Almighty. When your people, Lord God Almighty, are depressed, uh, oh Father God Almighty, you are there to impress uh, in the mighty name of Jesus, uh, my. God Almighty Lord, uh, we thank you, oh God, uh, that there is rising up in you, uh, that there is hope in you, uh, that there is peace in you, uh, that there is joy in you, uh, that there is deliverance in you, uh, that there is healing in you, uh, that there is laughter in you, God, uh, in the name of Jesus, there is company in you, Father God Almighty, oh Father, business, ideas, intelligence, joy, knowledge, wisdom, uh, everything is in you, God, uh, my God and my King Lord all that we need and desire oh father god almighty is in you it is in you god and so father god we thank you we bless your name lord we worship and adore your father because god almighty lord you're never weary you're never weary you're never weary oh god almighty you're never weary oh god father god almighty you are never weary of us mighty god you're never weary of us mighty god almighty you never give up on us mighty god even when we have doubt you never give up on us father god almighty even when the battle seems like it's not going to be won you you never give up on us. Father God, you never fail to surprise us. Mighty God, you never fail, oh God Almighty Lord, to show up and to show off. My God, you never fail, oh God Almighty, to do exceedingly abundantly above all that we can ever ask or think. My God, you never fail to fight on our behalf. Father God, sometimes, oh God Almighty, even we, Lord God Almighty, we are trouble maker in the Lord. Father God, we trouble some people, God Almighty. We trouble them even when we're not supposed to trouble them. 
but God Almighty, because of your love and your mercy and your grace, mighty God of Daniel, you're not feared to come true on our behalf in the mighty name of Jesus. Sometimes we say some things that we know that we should not say to know God, but Father God Almighty, your love has no bone, mighty God Almighty, and so therefore God Almighty, sometimes you catch some of the words that we are saying, oh God Almighty, and not allow it to go up in the atmosphere, but you throw it into the sea of forgetfulness, my God, that the enemy will not be able to use it against us, and so Lord, we just want to thank you, oh glory be to God, that you are an on-time God, you are an on-time God, that you will always be there in the midst of every situation, oh glory be to God, we thank you. We thank you, Lord. Bless the name of Jesus. Lord, we thank you. Mighty God, we thank you. Oh, glory be to God. We thank you. Jesus, we thank you. Mighty God, it's a joy, it's a privilege, oh God Almighty, to come to you, Lord God, and to be in your presence, oh God. Oh, Lord God Almighty, when you're released, uh, oh God Almighty, the spirit of prayer, oh, glory be to God. I know I can embrace you, Jesus. Uh, oh, Father God Almighty, I sealed you here. Oh, bless the name of the Lord Jesus. I thank you. Oh, bless the name of the Lord Jesus. Continue, Lord. Do your thing. Hey, glory be to God Almighty. We thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Our next prayer point is Joel 2, 32. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And it says, and it shall come to pass that whosoever shall call on the name of the Lord shall be delivered. For in Mount Zion, in Jerusalem shall be deliverance. As the Lord had said, glory be to God. And in the remnant, remnant, hallelujah, whom the Lord shall call, hallelujah, glory be to God. And it shall come to pass that whosoever shall call on the name of the Lord shall be delivered as the Lord had said. And in the remnant whom the Lord shall call, glory be to God. Hallelujah, thank you, Jesus. Glory be to God. I want you to learn to other personalize this prayer pointer. Glory be to God. And it shall come to pass that whosoever shall call on the the name of the Lord shall be delivered for in um, Sophia house, glory be to God, in the United Kingdom shall be deliverance, glory be to God, as the Lord had said, and in the remnant whom the Lord shall call, and in Sophia whom the Lord shall call, glory be to God, personalize it, oh bless the name of the Lord Jesus, glory be to God, let us pray, oh bless the name of the Lord Jesus, Father, almighty God, I thank you, oh glory Glory be to God that it shall come to pass in the mighty name of Jesus. Glory be to God that Lord God Almighty, Lord Jesus, that Lord God Almighty, in the name of the Lord, oh God, when we call upon you, Father, that there shall be deliverance in the mighty name of Jesus. That Lord God Almighty, in my life, oh Lord, mighty God in the United Kingdom, oh God Almighty, there shall be deliverance in the mighty name of Jesus. Because as the Lord has said, oh God Almighty Lord Jesus, a remnant who he has called and because he has called me by his name, oh glory be to God Almighty. Therefore, there is a sign that the Lord God Almighty is inside of me in the mighty name of Jesus. In my house, oh bless the name of Jesus. The glory of the Lord shall stand in the name of Jesus. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Let's do this again. God Almighty, Lord, we just want to thank you. We just want to glorify you. We just want to lift you up and higher in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, as your word says in Joel 2, 32. Uh, oh, God Almighty, that it shall come to pass, uh, and that whomsoever shall call on the name of the Lord uh, shall be delivered. Uh, oh, glory be to God for in, oh, God Almighty, the kingdom mandate of Jesus Christ's ministry right here in the United Kingdom. Uh, glory be to God 
anyone that is in that house uh, shall be delivered. Uh, oh, glory be to God. There shall be deliverance uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, for the Lord has called his remnant uh, minister Sophia. Glory be to God. Uh, Lord God Almighty, I shall call. Uh, oh, bless the name of Jesus. Uh, he shall call out. Uh, oh, glory be to God. Messiah, community church. Uh, he shall call out Marian Jaden. Uh, he shall call out Brother Lincoln. Uh, he shall call out Sister Sharina. He shall call Call us, Sister Tara. He shall call us, Sister Anna. He shall call us, Sister Petrina. He shall call us, Sister Sarah. Glory be to God. He shall call us, Sister Odetta. He shall call us, Sister Jody Thompson. Oh, glory be to God for those that are in the background. Lord Jesus shall call you by your name. You may be hidden from man, but you are not hidden from God. In the mighty name of Jesus. So the Lord shall call you out in the name of Jesus. Those on the reap player. Oh, glory be to God. The Lord shall call you out uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, you are the remnant of the Lord God Almighty and he shall rest his right hand uh, upon you right now uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, for you shall have deliverance. Uh, your business shall be delivered. Uh, your oh, glory be to God. Your home uh, shall be delivered. Uh, your family shall have deliverance uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, your finance shall have deliverance. Uh, your health shall have deliverance. Deliverance in the mighty name of Jesus. The jailers shall be broken and there shall be deliverance in the mighty name of Jesus. The love of God shall be upon you, God, in the mighty name of Jesus. Glory be to God Almighty. There shall be deliverance in the mind. There shall be deliverance in the body. There shall be deliverance, oh God Almighty, in your system. In the mighty name of Jesus. For those that are called, oh glory be to God upon the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. There shall be deliverance in the mighty name of Jesus. My God and my King, I thank you that the kingdom mandate of Jesus Christ ministry, Lord God, I'm to the house where you live. Mighty God, there shall be deliverance in the mighty name of Jesus. And you shall set forth souls that need to be delivered, that need to be loose from all the bondage and the snares of the enemy in the mighty name of Jesus. And they shall be free in the name of Jesus. There shall be deliverance. In every hero of your life, uh, in the mighty name of Jesus, Lord, we thank you. Oh, Father God, we thank you, Lord Jesus. For even the crooked way, Lord, uh, shall become a straight, uh, and the mountain shall become a plain, uh, and the valley shall be lifted up uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, for even in the desert places, uh, that you shall make a way, Lord God, uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, mighty God and mighty Lord, uh, even the streams, oh God, um, shall be finding we in the desert uh, for your people to have water to drink uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, you will cast a way to escape uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, you shall give up Sheba, oh God and mighty Lord Jesus. Uh, and Yes, Lord God Almighty, for a ransom for your people in the mighty name of Jesus. You shall save, you shall heal, you will always deliver in the mighty name of Jesus. And your Lord God Almighty will set the captive free in the name of Jesus. Lord, we thank you, Lord, that we can call upon your name, Lord Jesus. Oh, Father God Almighty, that we shall be saved in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, I thank you for the beauty of your holiness. Oh, God Almighty, the joy, God Almighty, that you bestow, oh God Almighty, in our heart in the name name of Jesus. Lord, I thank you. Oh, God, I'm for your divine open doors. Oh, God, for your divine turnaround. In the mighty name of Jesus, my God, for the family, Lord Jesus, that I lost my God. Oh, dear, in the world of sinner, my God, mighty Lord, I thank you that you can release angels. Oh, God, I'm at your assignment to go for it. Oh, God, I'm mm. And to set them free, God, uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, my God, I uh, thank you, Lord God, for the divine turnaround. Uh, oh, God, for the divine change. Uh, my God, Almighty uh, Lord Jesus, uh, where the enemy has put us in a position uh, where there is a setback, oh God. Uh, my God, I uh, thank you, Lord Jesus, uh, that Lord God Almighty, that you will stand in the midst uh, and uh, pull us forward uh, and catapult us into greatness uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, for you are able, Lord God yeah, Almighty, bro, to do exceedingly time. abundantly above all that we can ever. Come on, no. Come on, so, Lord, no. I thank you. I thank you, Father God Almighty, because, Lord God Almighty, your hands are not short in the name of Jesus. My God, your hands are not short. My God Almighty, you are able, Lord God, to stand in the gap and to cast a way to escape. Oh, God, cast a step to step over in the name of Jesus. My God, you are able. You are able. 
you are able. My God Almighty, you are able. Father God Almighty, Lord Jesus. Jonah tried to run away from the assignment, but God, you put him back on the right track. And Lord God, even in his stubborn time, Father God Almighty, you sent forth, oh God Almighty, Lord Jesus, the raven, to feed him, oh God Almighty, Lord. You set forth shelter over his head. Father God Almighty, God, you are the God of patience. Oh God Almighty, to sit with us. Oh God, to plead with us. Father God, to beg us. Mighty God Almighty, to all Jesus, you will call. Oh, Father God Almighty, you never go weary. You never go tired. Mighty God of Daniel. And you will never stop, oh God, until the ninth hour, Lord. Father God Almighty, Lord, you're giving us chances, open chances. You're the God of second chance. And Lord, we just want to thank you. We just want to thank you. We just want to thank you, Lord. We just want to thank you that, Lord God Almighty, we can trust and depend upon you, Father, in the mighty name of Jesus. We glory for your name, O oh God, and we honor you, Lord. We tell you thanks. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Almighty God, we thank you. We glorify your name, Jesus. We thank you, Almighty God, that we can rest assured, Lord God Almighty, that we can depend upon you, Father. In the mighty name of Jesus, we glorify your name, Lord. Hallelujah, glory be to God. Jesus, we thank you, we thank you, we thank you. Father God, we thank you. We bless your name, oh God. Hallelujah, Lord. You are a great deliverer. You are a great deliverer, Lord. You are a great deliverer. You are a hiding place. Mighty God Almighty, you are our hiding place. My God Almighty, we can sit. Oh, God Almighty, upon you, Lord. And Father, you never go real. You never throw us aside. You will never give up on us, Almighty God. You are there at all times for us. Oh, Father God, we thank you. Oh, bless the name of the Lord Jesus. Gonna ask you all to unmute your mic. Let us pray for our children. Hallelujah, glory be to God. Let us pray for our children. Glory be to God. Never go into the presence of the Lord and not pray for your seed. Amen, glory be to God. Pray for your children glory be to god hallelujah thank you lord <clears throat> hallelujah thank you jesus <clears throat> John. glory be to god hallelujah thank you jesus hallelujah glory be to god father in the mighty <clears throat> In the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Lord, we just want to thank you. We just want to lift you up on high for you are worthy to be praised. You are worthy to receive all honor and glory. And so, Lord God Almighty, right now, in the mighty name of Jesus, we lift up, oh God Almighty, our children before you right now, God Almighty, Lord, you have called them, oh God Almighty, for such a time like this, oh God Almighty, Lord, you have kept them thus far, Lord God Almighty, in this land, oh God Almighty, right now, God Almighty, and so, Father, God Almighty, I pray right now that you're coming them cover them under your precious blood father god almighty cover our children under your precious blood father keep them oh god almighty in the palm of your hand keep them in the cliff of the rock where the enemy cannot do them no harm lord god almighty we pray god almighty that divine favor shall come upon our children right now in the mighty name of jesus father god almighty we pray god almighty that there no smoking demon father god almighty no alcoholic demon father god almighty no demon of young leadership oh god almighty no demon of prostitution. Father God Almighty shall lead our children astray. Oh God Almighty, I pray. God Almighty, the signs and wonder shall follow after them. In the mighty name of Jesus, mighty God Almighty, Lord, I pray, God, that Lord, that wherever they are, Lord Jesus, that Lord God will meet them in their point of needs. Oh God Almighty, Lord, we pray, God, that they might favor in the mighty name of Jesus, Lord God Almighty, I pray, God, that Lord, you will walk with us, Lord Father God, we're ever there, Lord Jesus, in the training area. Father God Almighty, I pray, God, that Lord Jesus, that you will release Angel up an assignment to be there with them. 
Father God Almighty, Lord, I pray, God, that no temptation, no trial, and no stress uh, shall take out our children. No mistaken identity. Father God Almighty will be able to delete uh, our children off the face of the earth. Father God, we pray in the mighty name of Jesus uh, that Lord God Almighty, you will watch over our family, our children, Father. Lord, I pray, God Almighty, Lord, that you will call them by their name. Call them out of their sleep. Call them out of their slumber. Call them, oh God Almighty, out of the place of idleness. Call them out of the place of stubbornness. Call them, Father God Almighty, out of the, oh God Almighty, the gang. Father God Almighty, the groupies and the clans. Father God, call them, oh God Almighty, Lord Jesus, out of the area, oh God Almighty, that you have not warranted them to be in. And Lord God Almighty, out of the clubhouse, out of the raving, out of the dancing. Father God Almighty, out of the, oh God Almighty, the smoker, oh God Almighty, the smoking house. Father God Almighty, out of the gambling house. Call them out of his father in the mighty name of Jesus. Father God Almighty, Lord, I pray in the name of Jesus, any association, any companionship, any friendship that they are in, Lord God Almighty, that will lead them astray. Father God Almighty, I put the blood of Jesus Christ of God upon our children. Oh God Almighty, for when the blood, uh, the enemies to the blood, uh, they will pass over them. Uh, and so Father God, it will deliver them out of uh, unruly companionship uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. Father God, we pray that our children uh, shall fulfill every purpose uh, that you have called them for to be fulfilled in the mighty name of Jesus. That they will not be left, uh, oh God Almighty, to idle away their lives uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. Father God Almighty, the enemy will not lead them astray into the place of frustration, depression, and stress. Uh, but Father God, put a fire of protection round and about our children right now in the name of Jesus. Father God, it's not by might nor by power, but it's by your spirit. And so, Father, let your spirit uh, be a deliverance upon our children. Father, as we call them by their name right now, God, we pray, God, that your blood shall locate them in the mighty name of Jesus. So I call for uh, Jason, Javin, Devon, Orlando, Precious, uh, Martina, glory be to God, Shan Duje, glory be to God, Tajay, Taj, oh God, TJ, Anna, oh God, Joshua, oh God Almighty, Jasmine, oh Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, Romelia, oh God, in the name of Jesus, oh God Almighty, Jesus, Brianna, oh bless the name of the Lord, oh God Almighty, Lord Jesus. Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord yes, Jesus. Lord. Father God Almighty, I call for Victoria. Vicky, Almighty God, Almighty Lord Jesus. Father God, locate these children, God, in the name of Jesus. My God and my King Lord, call them by their name, oh God Almighty, in the name of Jesus. Father God Almighty, Lord Jesus, we ask you, locate our children right now, God, and put the blood of Jesus upon them right now, God, in the name of Jesus. Father God, locate them right now. Right now, Father, in the name of Jesus, put the blood of Jesus upon him. In the mighty name of Jesus, for none of them shall go out before their time. None of them shall be lost. None of them shall be turned away. None of them, oh God Almighty, Lord Jesus, life shall be cut short. In the name of Jesus, no near miss, no accident, no death warrant. Oh God shall go out against them. None of them shall go beyond the bars. In the mighty name of Jesus, for you shall give your angel charge to cover them, Father, and for those of the names that I don't know, God Almighty, you shall go for it and cover them, Father, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Father, God, hide them in the secret of your tabernacle where the enemy cannot do them no uh, Father, God, locate every one of us here, our children, Father, God, in the mighty name of Jesus uh, and put your blood upon them. Uh, cover them right now, God, uh, in the mighty name of Jesus, Father, God, cause them uh, to grow up, oh, God Almighty, and to be somebody of substance in the mighty name of Jesus. Let them be man and woman for God, of God in the mighty name of Jesus. Man and amen, woman of God, amen. that they shall live in the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 Amen.
God, that they will drop it off. Father God, where I be by swearing, where I be by smoking, where I be by drinking alcoholic, oh God Almighty, where to be, oh God Almighty, in the world. Father God Almighty, let me be deliverance in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Father God Almighty, Lord, any evil association that they have eliminated, remove them off of it, move them out of it, deliver them out of it in the mighty name of Jesus. Release the angels, oh God, to take them out of some friendship. Oh God Almighty, take them out of some association in the mighty name of Jesus. Cause them to prosper in the mighty name of Jesus. In every area of their life, in the mighty name of Jesus, my God and my King, oh God, we pray right now, God, that you shall locate the children in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, keep them, O God. Keep them in the palm of your hand. Keep them in the palm of your hand. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Keep them in the palm of your hand. In the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, cast them to dwell forth, O God Almighty, into your house, O Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus. That they might reverence God as the Lord and personal Savior. In the name of Jesus. Lord, I pray, God Almighty. That Lord, you will move, use them as your mouthpiece, uh, use them as your battle axe, uh, use them, oh God Almighty, as the keys, uh, use them, oh God Almighty, Lord Jesus, uh, to perform signs and wonders uh, in every area of life of people. In the mighty name of Jesus, my God, Lord God Almighty, I pray, God, uh, that they will feast at your table, Lord. Uh, uh, God, they will look to the hills and will commit their help. For the help comes from you, Almighty God, which made the heaven and earth, uh, and you will not cast their foot to be move in Jesus' mighty name, but you shall plant them, O God Almighty, like the tree that was planted by the rivers of water, that they might bring forth fruit in season and out of season, in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, we pray everyone that they communicate with, if they are not saved, O God, that they will draw them, O God Almighty, Lord, they, O God Almighty, into the presence of you, God, as Lord, we tell you thanks, in Jesus' mighty name. Glory be to God. Let us pray for pray for your husbands. Pray for your husbands. For those that you are here that are married, let's pray for her husband. And for those that are waiting, oh, glory be to God. And you desire to be married. Pray that the Lord will open the eyes of your husband. Glory be to God. That day he will have need of you. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And that God will locate you to your husband. That he will take you to your husband. Glory be to God. Because in the book of Genesis, it was God that take, uh, put Adam to sleep and take his rib and to create it Eve. And then he will bring Eve and present her unto Adam. Amen. Glory be to God. So let us pray that the Lord will present you unto your husband. Hallelujah. If you desire to be married. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. For those already unmarried. Married. Pray for your husband before he is the head of the home. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. And so therefore he has to make wise decision and he must love you as Christ do love the church. Amen. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Lord God Almighty, we thank you for everyone that is married right here, oh God Almighty, in your presence. And so Father God Almighty, we pray right now for those that are married. Lord, I pray God that you will touch their husband right now from the crown of his head to the sole of his feet. Oh God, sanctify him afresh. Lord God Almighty, Mighty, I pray, oh God Almighty, Lord, that he shall be rooted and grounded in your precious love, in the mighty name of Jesus. And Lord God Almighty, every husband shall love their wives as Christ do love the church, in the mighty name of Jesus. Father God Almighty, I pray, God, as he is the head of the home, oh God Almighty, I pray, oh God, that he will be able to make wise, wise, wise choices, ah uh, God Almighty, in the name of Jesus, because he's the head of the home, but he's, ah uh, God Almighty, you are the head of him. And so, Father God Almighty, I pray, oh God that Lord you will teach him you will guide him oh God you will fill him constantly with your word with your wisdom and knowledge in the mighty name of Jesus Father God Almighty that Lord you will be able to lead his children in the right direction you Lord God grow them up oh God Almighty as a seed unto you Father in the mighty name of Jesus Father God Almighty I pray oh God that Lord God Almighty he will be the peacemaker in the home oh God the provider of the home in the mighty name of Jesus Lord I pray God 
God, that the husband, oh God, shall take their rightful position and to look after their family, their children, in the mighty name of Jesus. And Father God, for those of the husband, that Lord God Almighty is going astray or a wire. Father, we pray, God, in the Jezebel spirit, oh God Almighty, Lord God, is messing with their mind, oh God, God Almighty, for oh their body, Father, let the fire of the anointing of the Holy Ghost, oh God Almighty, get them, oh God Almighty, Lord Jesus, and segregate any other spirit that is messing about with them in the mighty name of Jesus. Father God Almighty, I pray, God, that Lord God Almighty, every husband shall be able to walk circumspect in love of God in the mighty name of Jesus, to lead his home right in the sight of God, in the name of Jesus, Father, that Lord God Almighty, that they will not grow weary, oh God Almighty, and weaker, oh Father God Almighty, to know Jezebel's spirit on the outside, in the name of Jesus, but Father God Almighty, that they will keep their eyes on you, Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, mighty God, to be one, oh God Almighty, with their wife, in the mighty name of Jesus, Lord, I pray, oh God Almighty, that Father God Almighty, that they will stand in the gap of their family to pray, oh God Almighty, to lead them and to guide them, Father, in every area of their lives, in the name of Jesus, Father, that is willing to lead on his life for his wife, in the mighty name of Jesus, Lord, I pray, God, that Lord God Almighty, he will be the sustainer to sustain them in the presence of God, Lord God Almighty, that they shall pray together and stay together in the mighty name of Jesus, Lord God Almighty, I thank you for the chief and the change that you will do in the life of the husbands, oh God Almighty and Father, God Almighty, as they are the head, the women are the neck. Lord, I pray, God, uh, that the wife, oh God Almighty, Lord Jesus, will make it easy for the husband to lead, oh God, in the mighty name of Jesus, that they will not try to overtake uh, their husbands, oh God Almighty, that they will not try to overtake and uh, to take, uh, oh God Almighty, the wheel from the husband. Father, God Almighty, Lord, I pray, God, uh, that they shall be submissive unto their husband uh, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, uh, that Lord God Almighty, Lord Jesus, that they will not try oh father god almighty lord jesus to do oh god almighty some unusual things in their life in their marriage father god i pray god almighty that the husband the wives oh father god almighty shall surrender and be submissive to their husband father god almighty not to talk over them but to be submissive to be in right standing oh god almighty with their husband in the mighty name of jesus lord god almighty i pray god for those that are waiting oh god and believing you god for a husband to come for Lord, I pray, God, in the name of Jesus, wherever this husband is, Lord, I pray, God, that you will draw him unto yourself. Oh, Father, God Almighty, that you will set him apart for your glory in the mighty name of Jesus. And Lord, God Almighty, when he is fit and ready, oh, God, Lord, I pray that you will lead your daughter unto him in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, God Almighty, that you will open his eyes, that he will see her and she will see him. Oh, bless the name of Jesus and Lord God Almighty, that they will be the wife, oh God, she will be the wife of one husband, oh Father God Almighty, in the name of Jesus, Father Lord, I pray God uh, that there shall be a turnaround, oh God Almighty, in their life for the desire of those that are willing, oh God Almighty, and want to be married, Lord, we pray that you locate their husband right now, God, in the mighty name of Jesus, wash him with your blood, sanctify him afresh, put your mark of approval upon him, and Lord God Almighty, I pray that they shall be compatible in every area of their lives. In the mighty name of Jesus, Lord God Almighty, I pray, oh God, that you will breathe afresh upon this union, breathe afresh upon it, that it shall grow. In the mighty name of Jesus, and Lord God Almighty, that every children that I bring a birth into this marriage, Lord, I pray in the name of Jesus, that they shall work accordingly one with another. In the mighty name of Jesus, that they shall be a one accord. In the mighty name of Jesus, Lord God Almighty, I pray, God, uh, that they shall come together in unity and in love uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. And Lord God Almighty, we just want to tell you thanks uh, in Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Glory Jesus. be to God.
Glory be to thank God. You. Hallelujah. Thank Glory be to God. Father, God Almighty, we thank you. Let us pray for those that are in authority. Glory be to God. Those that are set over us. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Our pastors, oh God Almighty, the leaders of the country, Lord God Almighty, let us pray for them in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Please, you can open up your, your mic, unmute yourself. Glory be to God and join in in prayer. Glory be to God. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Lord, I lift up the pastors, the deacons, the missionary, uh, God Almighty, the evangelists, evangelists, the apostles, oh God Almighty, the bishops, Father God Almighty, I lift them up before you right now, God. Lord, I pray, God, that the Lord will touch them from the crown of their head and to the sole of their feet, the ministers, the end, the quiet, Lord, Lord God Almighty, the ushers, Lord, I pray, God, and those who oversee us, Father God Almighty, I pray, God, that you will speak mightily, oh God Almighty, in their midst, Father, I pray, oh God Almighty, that you will strengthen them, because Lord God Almighty, in this time, it's not easy. And so, Father, God Almighty, I pray, God, for the spirit of patience to be upon them. Lord, I pray, oh, God Almighty, that you will strengthen them. Lord, I pray, God, that you will fill their mouth with laughter. Fill their mouth, oh, God Almighty, with divine revelation from heaven. Lord, I pray, oh, God Almighty, that you will strengthen their ministry. Oh, God Almighty, help the minister to grow in the mighty name of Jesus. Send your destiny, help us, help me. Mighty God, kingdom builders. Lord, God Almighty, to come forth, oh, God Almighty, and assist the ministry in every area. Father, Lord, I pray, God, that the pastors, the, the, the leaders, oh God Almighty, that Lord, they will come together and work as one because we're all going to the same heaven. And so, Father, God Almighty, I pray in the name of Jesus, oh Lord, that we'll be able to network and to cooperate here in earth in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, God Almighty, I pray, God, that Lord, God Almighty, that Lord, you mightily in their lives, Almighty God. Larry, well, God Almighty, where deliverance is needed, let there be deliverance. Where there is healing, let there be healing, oh God Almighty. Lord, we pray, God Almighty, that Father, God Almighty, that you will wash them thoroughly with your precious blood. Sanctify them afresh. Glorify yourself in their lives, in their family, in their ministry. In the mighty name of Jesus, Lord God Almighty, I pray, God Almighty, that the blood of Jesus and the fire of the Holy Spirit shall arise, oh God Almighty, in the life of the pastors, the leaders, the bishops, Oh God Almighty Lord, the, the ministers, oh Father God Almighty, the prophet, the prophetess, mighty God, the choir stand, oh God Almighty, the ushers, the deacons, oh God, the deaconess, mighty God, for those that are in authority in the house of God, Lord, I pray God that you will connect them to the throne room of heaven, that the word shall come forth, oh God, divine revelation shall flow from their mouth in the mighty name of Jesus, Father God, that Lord Jesus, you give them unusual tongues, divine tongues from heaven, in the mighty name of Jesus, Father God Almighty, everything that they desire and need it, oh God Almighty, to do the work as Christ Jesus did it here on earth, so shall it be upon them in the mighty name of Jesus, cause them, oh God, to prosper, in every area, Father God, and nourish them, oh God, with the nourishment of heaven, in the mighty name of Jesus, Father God, cause them to be sustained by your glory, by your power, by your strength, in the mighty name of Jesus, Father, it's not easy at times, but Lord God Almighty, I pray, God, with your outstretched arm, that they will continue, oh God Almighty, will stretch out to you, Father, oh God, so you can hold them in the palm of your hands, in the mighty name of Jesus, Father God, that they will drink from your reservoir in every area of their life and their ministry in the mighty name of Jesus. Father God Almighty, I lift up, oh God. Yes, the prime ministers, oh God Almighty, the leaders, the oppositions yes, of the country, the dictators. Father God Almighty, I pray God that they will make wise decisions, oh God Almighty, in the country, oh Father God, that they will do the according to the will of God in the mighty name of Jesus. Father God Almighty, I pray God Almighty that they will repent from their sins, oh God, that they will surrender unto you, Father, that Lord God Almighty, that they will look to the ills and when come their help, for the help come from you, Almighty God, which made the heaven and the earth. Father, I pray, God, that they will have a divine connection with you, God, that they will hear wise counsel from you, God Almighty, and do that which you have called them for to do, Father, in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, we pray, God, that they will not, oh God Almighty, assign themselves, oh God, to the black man and the black world of the underground. But Father, I pray, oh Almighty God, that they will serve you in 
Contention, oh God, no evil contention, oh God Almighty, will be able to spread over the country, over the UK. Father God Almighty, that they will not make no mandatory, evil mandatory over the country in the mighty name of Jesus. So Father, put a blood right over the country, oh God Almighty, over this world, over the United States of America, United Kingdom, oh God Almighty, in the Asia, Africa, oh mighty God, the Caribbean islands. Almighty God, I pray, God, in the name of Jesus, any banner that they have put over it, Father God Almighty, to cause an obstruction for your people to go abroad. Lord, I pray that it shall be lifted up in the mighty name of Jesus. Father God, I pray that you step in and fight the battle and uplift up any banner that they place upon the land that is not of God. In the mighty name of Jesus, Lord, I pray, God Almighty, that there shall be a flushing in the system in the mighty name of Jesus and Lord God Almighty we pray that there shall be a change that there shall be a turnaround that there shall be a shift in the mighty name of Jesus change the decision of the kings in Jesus mighty name we pray amen and amen glory be to God Hallelujah. Glory be to God. We thank you, mighty God. We thank you, Heavenly Father. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. I shall just do the covering prayer right now. Glory be to God. And then I'll turn over to Sister Shireen. Glory be to God. So, Father God Almighty, right now, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, I lift up Sister Jody and Thomas. Hallelujah. Sister Odette Watts. Oh, God Almighty, Sister Anna, Sister Petrina, Brother Lincoln, and um, Brother Tajay. Taje, glory be to God, Sister Marlene, Sister Tara, Sister Marie, Brother Jaden, Sister Shireen, Sister Sarah, glory be to God and myself, Almighty God, I lift up those that are on, oh God Almighty, on the background watching, Lord, I pray right now, God Almighty, that Lord, you'll watch each and every one of us with your precious Lord, sanctify us afresh, cover our home, our family, our children, our business, our finance, oh God Almighty, under your precious Lord, our health, our ministry, cover it under your blood right now father in the mighty name of jesus lord we pray oh god almighty we thank you oh god that we are on the winning side and we thank you for your divine elevation we thank you for your lifting up we thank you oh god almighty for your divine protection your covering we thank you for your peace we thank you for your joy your happiness your turnaround we thank you oh god almighty that you will open up doors that no man can shut we thank you oh god almighty that you will make a way where there seems to be no way we thank you for the prison door that shall be broken in the mighty name of Jesus, we thank you, oh God Almighty, for your deliverance of good news. Oh God, we thank you for the testimonies. We thank you, oh God Almighty, for the change and the turnaround, divine health and strength. We thank you, oh God Almighty, for all that you're about to do in our lives. And Father, we pray, God, for every family members that are not yet saved. Lord, I pray, God Almighty, that you will visit them, that Lord, you will locate them, Lord God Almighty, to deliver them out of the slumber, oh God Almighty, of sin. And Father, God Almighty, that they shall turn their lives around oh god i'm to accept you there within in the mighty name of jesus father god we pray god that a swift move shall move upon our family on an extended family who are not yet saved in the mighty name of jesus that they too can experience you as the lord and personal savior father we thank you for your turn around we thank you that our spirit man has come alive oh god almighty and the spirit of prayer has rest upon us and we abide in you and we glorify your name and so lord we we shall rejoice in your power and in your presence in the mighty name of Jesus. As Lord, we tell you thanks in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Over to you, Sister Shireen. Glory be to God. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Heavenly Father, we Glory just to God. want to thank you for Amen. tonight, Father. We thank you for, thank you. you know, the great encouragement. Thank we thank you for your words that has been spoken over us, Father. Lord, we pray that you would honor um, your words that has been spoken to us, Father. 
Father, we pray that you'd activate it in our lives, Lord, and, and bring it to life in us, Father, in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, I just lift up every person um, that feels weak, Father, that feels hopeless. Father, according to Isaiah 40, verse 29, it says, Father, that you give power to the weak, and to those who have no might, Father, you increase their strength. Father, I pray that you would increase the strength and the might of your people. Father, we even pray for those, Father, who feel hopeless and suicidal. Father, we just pray that you would break off that curse off of their lives. Father, we pray that you would break off the oppression of the enemy from off of the lives of your people lord god lord we pray that you'd have mercy hallelujah father i pray that you touch your people strengthen them increase their strength increase their might father give them hope father for whatever it is that they're going through father whether it is a lack with whether it is sickness and diseases father god we pray that you'd meet the needs of your people father even as we're living in such troublesome times father god where we hear of wars and rumors of wars and famines and all sorts of negative news and negative decrees father we trust you to uh, bring hope to us to protect us father god mighty god to continue to speak over us father to continue to spread your blood over us over our families over this nation, Father God, to protect us, to hide um, your people, Lord, to have mercy upon your people, Father God, to, to provide strong leadership for your people, Father, whether it's in our communities, whether it's in our countries, Father, whether it is in our homes, Father, we cry out for strong leadership, Father God for righteous leadership father god in the mighty name of jesus yes lord mighty god we pray that you just have your way father as we're about to go one from another lord god we pray that you would just cover us under your divine blood in the mighty name of jesus we pray that you'd hide us under your wings in your secret place father god we pray that you'd close every entrance close every door father god by which the enemy would come into our lives to cause chaos and to cause um, discontent, Father God, and to cause arguments and frustrations. Lord, we pray that those doors would be just closed now by the blood of Jesus, Father God. We pray that you change um, the, the stories and the lives of your people and advance your purposes in their lives, Father. Lord God, we lift your servant before you. We pray that you'd soak her in your blood. Father God, we pray that you'd hide her mighty God under your most powerful hand in the mighty name of Jesus father we pray that you continue to do exploits for her father in the mighty name of Jesus we pray that you'd close every entrance of the enemy into our life father God mighty God father we pray that you disconnect her from every place father where she should not be Lord God in the mighty name of Jesus whether even that's physical or spiritually father God God, you'd remove her from any place, Father God, that is holding her back, Lord God, in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, have your way, Lord God. Remember all your people, those who will listen later, Father God. We pray that you'd anoint their ears to hear and their hearts to receive you in the mighty name of Jesus, Lord God. We pray for those, Father, who are dying and lost without you, Father God. We pray that they would find you, Father God, mighty God. We pray that they'll be able to connect to the hem of your garment, Father God, so that they can be healed and restored, Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we just honor you for everything that you're doing, Lord God, and we just want to tell you thanks in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Glory be to God. Bless you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Lord. Thank you. Makalabas tikan dekeleke besikete. Mm, Jesus. Kude be shike meleke. Sikente kerebe. Sike tukumureke. Sike mbereke. Sikete. 
e to riba sika to rigete ko to raba sika tu ka palike sika madike shia Yes, Lord, whose report will we believe, Father? Nah, 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 Father, nah, nah, we nah. shall believe nah. the report of the nah. Lord in the mighty name of Jesus. We choose to believe the report of the Lord. His report says we are free. His report says victory. De ghost, get the get the culture, go take a leg, get it. The gala gabasuka lava, seek a pelic, shake it to come a la cassia. Eco to yada katana basicate. Caleba shake it to lava sacatia. Moyabo shiko to robo sacatica delegate. And they, maha. Tina masica take a leg, take a sea. She masica to robo sacata. Yes, Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Release your battalion of angels, Father. Release your angels, Father. Release your angels. Release your angels. Release your angels. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, glory, hallelujah. Glory, hallelujah. Glory, hallelujah. Glory, Lord. Oh, Jesus, hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah, glory be to God. Mm. Glory be to God. Just what it says, my children are in my perfect will. In time they will reap when the harvest has come. That's the word, hallelujah, that has been given. Glory be to God. That's the word that was come through. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. At this point, hallelujah, you're going to say thank you all. Facebook, hallelujah, still speaking. I am the Lord, dear God, and I never sleep nor slumber. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Bless the name of the Lord Jesus. Glory be to God. Thank you, Jesus. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. We bless your name, Jesus. Glory be to God. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. As we have come, to the end of our prime meeting this evening. Hallelujah. Mm. Glory be to God. My arms is not too short where it cannot reach. Amen. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Glory be to God. Let's just wait on him. Amen. A shift is coming. But preserve. Persevere. But persevere. A shift is coming. But persevere. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Thank you, Jesus. Glory be to God. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Jeremiah 33, verse 3. Amen. Glory be to God. Jeremiah 33 and verse 3. Glory be to God. 
Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Glory be to God. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Jesus. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Thank you, Jesus. We have come to the end of our prayer meeting this evening. And we're going to say thank you for those that are here on Facebook, Sister Odette, Sister Jody. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Thank you for being here. And for those that are watching in the background, we thank you for your viewing. We thank you. We're going to ask you to come back again next week, Thursday, same place, same time. We are here. Glory be to God. And better yet, you can join us on the Kingdom Mandate of Jesus Christ Ministry on the YouTube channel. I would ask you, please, could you go there to subscribe? Hallelujah. Subscribe, subscribe like, share. Hallelujah. And even comment at the Kingdom Mandate of Jesus Christ Ministry on the YouTube channel where we can grow our family, our community. Amen. Glory be to God. Just you can go back there and watch the replay as well as here on Facebook. Glory be to God. Continue to do what you are doing. And if the Kingdom Mandate Jesus Christ of Ministry is a blessing in your life, please comment. Let your comment be made known. And we thank you all for being here with us. Amen. As we say goodbye, see you all again next week. Amen. Glory be to God. Goodbye, Facebook. See you next week. God bless you.